Ngayon yung mag-graph naman tayo ng mga logarithmic functions at yung iba't ibang translation ng ating graph doon sa x-axis at sa y-axis. So, yung number, number one, kailangan nating i-graph si log of x minus 1 to the base 6 minus 5. Now, to illustrate yung uh, translation ng function na ito, alam natin na yung graph ng logarithmic ay merong point of intersection sa... 0 or sa 1, 0. So, yung ating vertical asymptote lagi ay nandito sa um, x equal to 0 at saka meron tayong vertical axis na y equals x. So, ito yung graph ng basic logarithmic function. So, yung ini-illustrate ko, ito yung graph ng log of Let's say log of x to the base 6. So, ito yung graph ng log of 6 to the base x. Pero ang kailangan natin graph is log of x minus 1 to the base 6 minus 5. So, ibig sabihin nun, from the point of inflection dito sa 1, mag move tayo ng 1 to the right kasi yun yung opposite sign ng x minus 1. So, 1 unit to the right and then 5 units going down. So, we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So, ito ngayon yung ating point of inflection at yung ating vertical asymptote ay dito ngayon sa x equal to 1. At syempre, bababa din yung ating vertical asymptote ng isang unit. So, ito yung ating vertical asymptote. So, yung ating graph would be um, so here um, 1, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So, ito yung ating vertical asymptote. So, yung sketch ng graph natin would be something like this. So, yan yung graph ng function na log of x minus 1 to the base 6 minus 5. Now, yung graph naman ng x minus 1 plus 3, so alam natin ulit dito mag-uumpisa yung, yung log of x. So, quick sketch ng log of log of x to the base 5. At yung graph naman ng log of x minus 1, 1 unit to the right, and then 3 units up. 1, 2, 3. So, ito ngayon yung ating point of inflection, yung ating vertical asymptote dito pa rin, at yung ating vertical or diagonal asymptote or slant asymptote would be one unit up doon sa ating point of inflection. So, yung ating namang susunod na graph, so, i-graph uli natin yung basic function ng log of x to the base 6. So, lagi siyang 0, 1. At lagi siyang may asymptote na vertical asymptote dito. At meron tayo laging diagonal asymptote na 1 unit up. So, ito yung ating basic function ng logarithm of x base 6. At yung ating translation would be x minus 3. So, 1, 2, Three, and then 5 units down. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So, ito yung ating point of inflection. So, yung ating vertical asymptote would be here at 3. At yung ating slant asymptote would be 1 unit up. So, ito yung asymptote natin. Or slant asymptote. So, ito yung graph ng log of x minus 3 to the base 6 minus 5. At dun sa susunod naman, meron tayong log of x minus 1 to the base 2 plus 3. So, notice yung base natin, um, hindi naman siya nakaka-apekto dun sa itsura ng graph, pero yung ating mga constants at saka yung uh, um, value or number right next to x, yun yung nag affect nung ating graph ng function. So, graph ulit natin yung basic function natin na logarithm. Log of log of x base 2 which is pare parehas lang naman katulad ng mga nauna nating basic graph. Yung translation ang mag-iiba 
So, meron tayong 1 to the right and then 3 up. 1, 2, 3. So, ito yung ating point of inflection. Ito yung ating vertical asymptote. At ito yung ating slant asymptote. So, yung ating graph would be going up. And right here. So, to yung graph nung log of x minus 1 plus x minus 1 to the base 2 plus 3. Now, yung susunod naman, graph uli natin si basic graph para makita nyo yung translation. So, ito yung ating log of x base 4. At yung ating graph would be from here since plus 1 siya, so 1 to the left. And then, 4 units down. So, ito ngayon yung ating bagong point of inflection. At yung ating vertical asymptote would be 1 unit to the left of the point of inflection. And then, yung ating slant asymptote would be 1 unit up from the point of inflection. So, ito yung graph ng ating function number 5 and so function number 6 again yung ating basic function at yung ating log of x plus 1 so 1 unit to the left and then 1 unit up so ito yung point of inflection at ito yung ating vertical asymptote at yung slant asymptote natin is 1 unit up. So this is the graph of log of x plus 1 to the base 5 plus 1. At ganyan yung pag-graph ng mga logarithmic functions at yung kanya mga translations from its basic graph. At kung mayroon kayong natutunan sa video na ito, please like, share, and uh, subscribe to my channel. Thank you.